13 days that he is here at KHMH. And uh, he's showing improvement, but it will go slow, slow. And um, the situation, he is still um, very sad because I could see the people that do it and uh, they could laugh, they could eat, they could sleep, they could show, they could do anything. But my son don't have that opportunity yet. So still getting blessing from our God, which we, we don't know what the law will do or anything, but um, they are free, like I said. You know. Is he is he talking? Is he opening his his eyes? Does he recognize anybody? Can you tell us exactly his condition? Well, he can hear me, can listen when I talk to him, open his eyes and so, but not completely. So it's just matter of time. Has he been able to say anything? <laughs> not yet. Okay. What what are the doctors um, telling you? Is do they expect mm -hmm. that he will recover? That he will make a full recovery? Okay, the doctors, as I mentioned before, they still continue saying it will be a miracle because they don't promise, him, promise me anything. They are not doing, like, uh, they're not giving me, like, hopes or anything, but, but I, I believe in God, and God did a miracle already, and I, I know it's coming, coming back slowly. But, um, like I said, I just want to say thank you to all these people that give us the prayers, helping us in prayers, and uh, with us. We saw that Belize is, has a lot of good people, only a few that are very bad, you know, really don't think, they don't have a heart, especially people like, you know, Adrian Matura, Johnny Rosado, his workers, they don't have a heart. They don't feel like they have a son or daughter or something. I would never like somebody to do something like that to one of the family. This is very hard. It's very hard. I never, ever, ever cry so much like this time.